LastPass syncs with Active Directory to automate account provisioning, deprovisioning, and user group management. By syncing with AD, you can feed relevant information about your users directly to LastPass. You only need to maintain a one-way authoritative source of data that syncs in real time that cannot be manipulated by LastPass. IT teams benefit from more efficient user management and better protection from rogue employees. Businesses with more than 10,000 users have successfully used the LastPass AD client to deploy and manage LastPass in their organization. With LastPass AD Connector, you can feed relevant information from your user directory into LastPass. You can also sync new user profiles for automated provisioning of LastPass user accounts. You can sync disabled or deleted user profiles for automated termination of LastPass user accounts. And you can create nested groups to manage permissions at the group level. You can also sync user groups to LastPass to assign policies, shared folders, and cloud applications. You can apply group-based filters so that only members of relevant groups are synced to LastPass. And you can provision a number of cloud-based applications, including Google Apps and Salesforce.com. When you add the user in AD, LastPass takes it from there and no local provisioning is necessary. Our AD connector only pulls username, first name, and last name, email address, account status, and group member from your AD system using LDAP. This data is securely transferred to LastPass using SSL. The LastPass AD connector can be installed and configured in less than an hour. You may run the service on a dedicated workstation or server running Windows XP or later. Or you can run it on multiple computers for redundancy. In general, the AD Sync client requires very little computer resources and should be deployed within your firewall. To download AD Connector, open the Admin Dashboard to the Users tab. Select the option to create new user and download options are under LastPass Active Directory Sync Client. After you run the MSI installer, log in with your LastPass credentials. Any enterprise admin can log in to the client and you do not need a designated admin account for AD. The authentication token used is not bound to the admin account you use to configure AD Connector. Our lightweight client provides a wizard-like interface so you can quickly select the configuration options that best suit your environment. After logging in for the first time, you will see the Home tab where you will check the health status of the service and the connection, as well as enable or disable syncing to LastPass. When you first run the client, the only option available is to enable sync, but this cannot be selected until you have configured the AD connection. Note that starting with a partially configured AD connector may result in unexpected behavior. In the Connection tab, you will start by configuring the connection between LastPass and your Active Directory. This is where you can set the details about how to connect to your Active Directory. First, specify an AD domain to automatically scan for your base DN. Typically, you will not want to select the option to fall back on an unsecured protocol if SSL fails, but this is dependent on your particular environment. For the credentials, you can connect with the same LastPass account you authenticated with, or you can use another LastPass account. Next, you can have LastPass automatically scan for the base DN, or you can specify the root node under which all your relevant user and group objects are located, either by typing it in directly or browsing your directory. We do advise caution when narrowing the scope in AD. For proper operation, all relevant users and their embedded groups must be under the specified base DN. After configuring your connection, click on Actions to configure the account provisioning and deletion options. You can leave the default options in place or you can specify what actions should be performed instead when certain events happen to users in the Active Directory. For example, if a new user profile is detected, you can choose to add the user in the Enterprise Dashboard but require admin approval. This option will sync users between your AD and LastPass, but the user will be listed as Pending in the Users tab of the Admin Dashboard. This means the user must be approved by an admin before the account is created or you can choose to automatically create the user in LastPass. When this option is enabled, LastPass will automatically create accounts for every new user and send them an automated welcome email with a temporary password and instructions to create their individual master password. You can also choose to do nothing. When a, for when a user profile is deleted or disabled, or when a user is removed from a group in filtering, you can choose one of the following options. You can have that user administratively disabled. 
This will lock the enterprise account and free up the license for use, but the account itself will still exist and still be a part of the enterprise. You can remove the user from the enterprise account, but not delete them. This will remove the account from the enterprise system and free up the license, and it will also turn the account into a regular free LastPass account. All the data within the account will still be available for the user to use, and it means they will now have complete control over it as a personal LastPass account. Or you can choose to automatically de delete their LastPass account. This will completely delete the LastPass account and all data in it. The license will be available for use on another account. We recommend using the disable option instead of delete or remove from company. In case a mistake is made, admins will be able to more easily correct the issue if the user is disabled rather than deleted or removed. When you're done configuring the actions, click Sync to configure the fields, groups, and users that you would like to sync between LastPass and your Active Directory. You can select the option to sync a user's full name from AD. By default, LastPass only lists users by their username or email address. However, when this option is enabled, the client will sync the full name of all users to LastPass. This corresponds to the display name field in a user's directory profile. You can also choose to create groups in LastPass, so that if a group exists in AD but not in LastPass, this option will ensure that those groups are correspondingly created in LastPass as well. For the sync search interval, this is how often you want LastPass to check for changes in your AD. If you've chosen to disable sync LDAP query, selecting this option will force the AD client to search for and update changes in the hourly interval that you've specified. To filter users, you can limit what users are added to your enterprise by syncing a specific filter within the AD sync client. You can also select whether all or only some group memberships are synced. Nested groups are also supported, so that adding group A includes the users in that group and also in its subgroups. If you do encounter any issues, the debug tab offers options that will help us investigate and diagnose any problems. Set the logging level to trace before collecting log files to help us diagnose any issues. Use the option to clear the local cache when you encounter issues and want to try again, or if you change the group filter and want to rescan all items. When you've completed the configuration of all options, click Update Settings and Enable Sync to LastPass. The application window can be closed and the app will continue to run in the system tray. You can then launch the admin dashboard in your browser to review any users or pending users as data is fed from your Active Directory to LastPass. Depending on how many users are in your directory, it may take only a few minutes or over an hour for everything to appear in your admin dashboard. Now that your setup is complete, LastPass will continually listen for changes in your Active Directory and continue to add and remove users accordingly. By syncing your Active Directory to LastPass, you will automate these user management tasks and better secure your company against threats both internal and external.